Vitamin D, also referred to as calciferol, is a fat-soluble vitamin that is naturally present in a few foods, added to others, and available as a dietary supplement. It is also produced endogenously when ultraviolet, UV, rays from sunlight strike the skin and trigger vitamin D synthesis. Links to buy this are below. Vitamin D3 and K2 work in partnership to support healthy bones. Vitamin K2 works together with vitamin D3 to support healthy bones. In simple terms, vitamin K2 helps to make sure that calcium is deposited where it needs to be in the bones and not elsewhere such as the arteries. Research has found the combined use of vitamin K2 and D3 to be more effective than either nutrient alone for preventing bone loss and for improving bone mineral density. Vitamin D3 and vitamin K2 ensure that calcium is absorbed easily and reaches the bone mass, while preventing arterial calcification. Helping to keep your heart and bones healthy. Separately, K2 regulates normal blood clotting, whilst D3 supports a healthy immune system and supports muscle function. Vitamin D helps regulate the amount of calcium and phosphate in the body. These nutrients are needed to keep bones, teeth and muscles healthy. A lack of vitamin D can lead to bone deformities such as rickets in children, and bone pain caused by a condition called osteomalacia in adults. Government advice is that everyone should consider taking a daily vitamin D supplement during the autumn and winter. People at high risk of not getting enough vitamin D, all children aged 1 to 4, and all babies, unless they're having more than 500 milliliters of infant formula a day, should take a daily supplement throughout the year. Information There have been some reports about vitamin D reducing the risk of coronavirus, COVID-19. But there is currently not enough evidence to support taking vitamin D solely to prevent or treat COVID-19. Good Sources of Vitamin D From about late March slash early April to the end of September, most people should be able to make all the vitamin D they need from sunlight. The body creates vitamin D from direct sunlight on the skin when outdoors. But between October and early March we do not make enough vitamin D from sunlight. Read more about vitamin D and sunlight. Vitamin D is also found in a small number of foods. Sources include Oily fish, such as salmon, sardines, herring and mackerel. Red meat. Liver. Egg yolks. Fortified foods, such as some fat spreads and breakfast cereals. Another source of vitamin D is dietary supplements. In the UK, cow's milk is generally not a good source of vitamin D because it is not fortified, as it is in some other countries. Links to buy this are below.